What's up everybody? In this video, I'm going to show you how to add different coins to MetaMask wallet. So for example, if you decide to add different coins to your MetaMask based on certain blockchain, here's what you need to do. First, choose your blockchain for this video tutorial. I'm going to be using Ethereum, but it's going to be exactly the same. If you would like to add on a different chain, for example, Binance Smart Chain, Polygon or Avalanche or any other chains. So scroll down. So first choose your blockchain, then scroll down and then right here, press on import token. And then in here, you'll have two different options. One of them search option, second one custom token. In the search option, you can just type token that you're looking for. So for example, Uniswap, and you can just add right here, just press on it and then press next and then import token. And that's it. Uniswap is added and you can go back and then scroll down right here and then you're going to see token, the one you just added. Or for example, if you go back to import tokens and then you start searching for it and it's not here, then what you need to do, you need to press on custom token. Then we need to get token contract address. So for this video tutorial, we're just going to pull up from CoinGecko, let's say FTX, and then let's say on CoinGecko, you found some kind of coin and you would like to add to your MetaMask. So multiple ways you can do it. If for example, next to contract address, you're going to be able to see this little fox. If you press on it, it's technically supposed to add automatically. So when you press on it, you'll get this pop-up box and then you can press add token and it's going to add FTT token automatically. And you just press on add and it's going to add. For example, if that's not going to work or you found tokens somewhere else on some kind of website, what you need to do, you need to copy contract address from the website or I'm just going to copy from here. So click to copy, press it. So address is copied. Then you go back to MetaMask, scroll down, import tokens, custom token. And right here we need to paste contract address, paste. And by default token symbol and decimal is going to be filled out. But if for some reason it's not going to be filled out, then on the website, you will have to find token symbol and decimal. And then same thing, press add custom token and then import token. And that's it. You go back, you can see all the tokens that we just added. And this method is going to work for any chain you're trying to add in MetaMask wallet. And if this video is helpful to you, press that like button and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.